but we just got back from nashville on bus 59 and uh i was going to show y'all this was the first bus i ever rode to school i got a bus 57 dad drove it when i started kindergarten and uh motor went down in it right before uh he got bus 57 or bus 71 so this is the bus that i rode prior to bus 71. a whole lot of these old gmc's uh, right there sets one that's number 24. they got it full piled full of junk them was good old buses right there though you can tell this one's pretty old it didn't even have amber lights this one over here it has uh has amber lights on it both of them's got good hoods and stuff on them I don't know why they got this and it just looks like a pile full of garbage mostly. I'd like to look the inside of it. But I just thought I'd show y'all that real quick while I was over here waiting on Tiffany to come uh, come pick me up. But I'd like to have looked in it. if we can see anything through the driver's window here maybe let's look and see if we can nope it's piled full too it's piled full too old seats and looks like most of that stuff in there probably needs just to be thrown away gmc diesel 6000 8.2 detroit's what them had in them But, hope y'all have been doing good, and we had a pretty good trip to Nashville. Ended up a couple of them testing positive for COVID while we was down there, and uh, didn't have no choice but them to ride home with us on the bus, so fingers crossed. Now the rest of us will uh, get it. All right, we built the fenders on this trailer a few years ago. A few years ago. But, I guess that's it. Appreciate you watching, and uh, we'll talk to you later.